Hello everyone, Daily Wizards here, coming at you with another video. In today's video, I'm going to be talking about the awesome news that um, Sony Pictures Entertainment and Marvel have worked out a deal on bringing Spider-Man to the amazing world of Marvel. This is crazy. This is crazy, crazy news. I didn't think that um, did actually strike a deal. I mean, we've heard about this for the for months and months about him possibly appearing in Civil War, having a cameo in Civil War. Um, but yeah, this is official. Um, so yeah, he's going to be in a movie before um, before he gets his own solo movie that Kevin Feige himself is producing. Oh my God! So yeah, he's probably going to be in Civil War by now. I'm pretty sure he's going to have like a, he's going to be the post-credit scene. It's probably going to be like some shot of him as a kid because we all we all know his backstory. I mean, he's probably going to get name dropped in. Um, as I think as early as um, Age of Ultron they're going to give him a name drop because I mean that that would be just logical can you imagine everybody in the theatres as well oh my god but yeah guys um, uh, Sony still retain um, distribution rights and they still have um, they still say what, what goes so um, Marvel are just be like hey do you think this idea is good and they basically have to say whatever they do and don't but at this point I'm pretty sure they're just going to be like yeah sure Marvel you just go ahead and do you because I mean at the end of the day Marvel know what they do with the properties I mean they made frigging uh, Guardians of the Galaxy the one a big, the biggest film of 2014 uh, box office wise and I think actually just movie wise it was one of the best movies of 2014 and now um, Spider-Man is, is going to be taking, he's going to have a, his own solo movie taking for Ragnarok space in the July 28th, 2017, I believe so. So Spider-Man, Spider-Man's just basically pushed all of these awesome movies back, which I'm a bit sad about because I would, I'd love a Black Panther movie. But yeah, well obviously it's still happening, which is getting pushed back, so I'd love a Black Panther movie as soon as possible, but that's not going to happen, we're having a new Spider-Man. Um, He's going to be in Civil War by now, it's, it's, it's a guarantee, that's that's the move they're talking about, how they're going to introduce him to a movie. Um, so, yeah guys, I mean, wow, what absolutely crazy, crazy, crazy news um, to be waking up to for me. Uh, every, it's just blowing up everywhere. Um, but yeah, if credits to Kevin Feige, I mean, whew, he bright. <laughs> <laughs> Spider-Man's home. Spider-Man is home. I mean, there's so much directions it can go now. Spider-Man's officially going to be joining the Avengers sometime. Um, they'll be able to use characters and properties from the Marvel. I mean, from the Spider-Man universe. So we're going to have like Sinister Six. Maybe they've play a role in Civil War because I'm I'm pretty sure they made two drafts of the script. One with Spidey and one without Spidey. And then you're going to have Black Panther in there as well. So I think Black Panther is still going to be the centerpiece of um, Civil War, but I think Spider-Man's also going to play a role. But I don't think it's going to be as poignant as he was in the um, in the comics. So yeah, guys. I mean, I've been rambling on now for three minutes. I'm going to close up soon, but I'm just so pumped for this. I'm so excited that uh, this deal's actually happened. I was almost on the verge of crying when I saw it. I was just so pumped. I've been wanting Spider-Man in the MCU for for a very very long time now, and yeah, I don't want him to do Peter Parker Spider-Man. I want him to do Miles Morales. But, you know, that's just me. I mean, come on. Let's just get a bit of uh, diversity in there. Let's get a new a new Spider-Man. Everybody's seen Parker for friggin' for about 10 years now. For like 15 years now, actually. We've just been seeing Parker, Parker, Parker. Let's get a new, new fresh face in. But yeah, I'm a bit sad that Andrew Garfield will not be continuing his reign as Spider-Man. He was a very, very good Spider-Man, I felt. I think he was a perfect Spider-Man, but they can bring somebody else in. I mean, Jesus Christ. It's happening, guys. Marvel and Sony have struck a deal in regards to Spider-Man. He's joining the cinematic universe. He's going to be in... Can you imagine the posters and the just the... The um, the material for um, for Infinity Wars. This is gonna be absolutely crazy. But yeah, guys, that's enough of me rambling. I rambled for like five minutes now. I might bring a um, podcast video with a bunch of other YouTubers. So let's say a uh, like an hour podcast. That'll be absolutely amazing. Just us spitballing and us fanboy. But yeah, guys. So um, if you like this video or enjoyed it in any way, shape, or form, please hit the like button. I'll be going now. So adios, guys.